All right, welcome to another crappie moment. We are fishing. I've got my seven and a half foot ACC crappie sticks. I'm using 15 pound braid. Today, I am using a 16th, not, excuse me, I'm using an eighth ounce. I usually use a 16th ounce, but today I am using an eighth ounce uh, jig head. Right now I've got a orange and chartreuse strike king slabalicious paddle tail on there. Um, I've got me a little bead that I don't have a split shot on right now. I might add that later. Um, I've got this bead on there. A lot of people ask because uh, it helps uh, show up better on live scope. And a lot of times I'll add a, a extra split shot on there to help get the um, uh, jig down in the water uh, to where the fish are at a little bit quicker. Um, just depends on how deep we are. Uh, I usually do that um, uh, when we're in deeper water as well. So, and that's where we're at today. We're in that deeper water. So we're, we're going to talk about uh, January crappie today. So uh, hang in there. We're going to get to it. Uh, if you haven't hit that subscribe button, hit that subscribe button. I really appreciate all the subscribers for coming back and supporting the channel. Uh, smash that like button. It really helps the channel when you just hit that like button. Uh, just takes just a quick second. Hit that like button. Give it a thumbs up. Um, all right, let's get out here and let's get some crappie today. Now there's a tank right there. That is a very nice crappie. There he is. He saw it. Oh, come on. There he is. There he is. There he is. Oh, yeah. There's a good fish. There's a good fish. There we go. There is a nice copy. Alright, I got you, buddy. I got you. Okay, okay. Wow. There we go. Ha ha ha. Beautiful. Very nice fish. So, the truth about January crappie. January crappie, for the most part, they are going to be in the deepest part of your body of water. So today I, I'm fishing, you know, pretty much in the deepest area of, of this lake. You know, I'm fishing, you know, 30 feet of water, 40, you know, 45 feet of water. Um, if I, you know, chasing some fish closer uh, to the bank, you know, I could get into, you know, 20 feet of water and I'm seeing fish. So you're going to see crappie go to the deepest the deeper uh, part of your body of water is where these January crappie are going to be however that doesn't mean that you can't find crappie in shallower areas I have found crappie in 20 feet of water uh, I have found crappie in 10 feet of water and when I'm in that deeper water I am finding crappie that's just six seven eight foot down from the surface i'm seeing crappie you know in that 40 foot of water but they're up in the water column so you know yes generally speaking crappie are going to go to those deeper parts but you will still find crappie up in the creeks uh in january uh in, in, during that uh you know pretty much the coldest part of the season you will find crappie uh, up in the creeks in shallower areas you will see them chasing bait fish uh, the truth about january crappie is that crappie still have to eat 
they still have to feed. So yes, their activity level slows down. Yes, they definitely are not nearly as aggressive uh, as they are during, you know, the fall, the early fall or spring when they're, you know, aggressively defending beds and, you know, in the fall when they're chasing bait fish because they're feeding up for winter time. Uh, but they still have to eat. And so you can definitely still catch some nice crappie. I, I'm catching some nice crappie today in various water depths, you know, so, you know, that, so that's the truth. The truth is, you know, people say, uh, you can't catch crappie during the winter time or they're at the bottom. Uh, the crappie are always down on the bottom during the winter time, or the only place you can catch crappie during the winter time is, is bridges. The truth about January crappie fishing is that you can still catch them because they still got to eat and you can catch them in different water depths. You can catch them in those deeper parts of your body of water. Uh, you can catch them up in the creeks. Uh, you can catch them uh, in those mid ranges. Uh, you can catch them up in the water column in those deeper areas. Uh, yeah, you can catch them at bridges. Yes, you can catch crappie down toward the bottom. But the truth is that you can catch crappie in January in some of these other areas. Um, and, and, and yes, you can catch crappie. We're catching crappie January, having a great time. Go out there and get you some crappie. Let's see if we can get some more. Come on, fishy fish. There he is. Mm. Oh, he's fighting. Oh, he didn't like that very much. Oh, yeah, baby. Get in here. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, wow. Interesting. Get out of there. There's a nice fish. Good fish. Oh yeah, my goodness. Good fish. Mm-hmm. There we go. He saw that thing, he just came and slammed it. Let's try again. There it is. There it is. 
There's a crappie cutter you. Oh yeah. Get in this boat. <laughs> he wanted it. Oh yeah, he wanted it. <laughs> that thing is gone. My goodness. Get out of there. <laughs> Boom. He's like, good gracious. <laughs> I almost went for a swim, folks. <laughs> oh my goodness. There we go. noggin and he said too good to resist all right all right that's gonna do it folks appreciate y'all watching uh, remember the truth about crappie fishing all right uh, they can be deep uh, but they can also be in some of that shallower water but just because you're fishing in the deep water doesn't mean they're down at the bottom they could be up higher in the water column sometimes just a few feet below the surface you can catch crappie during the winter time at places other than the bottom and other at around bridges. Um, and don't forget, truth about crappie fishing is that just because it's winter time, just because it's January, the crappie still have to eat. Uh, go out there, catch you some crappie, uh, have a good time. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, please do that for me. I really do appreciate all my subscribers, uh, all the support. Uh, smash that like video if you enjoyed the video if you enjoyed the comment uh, enjoyed the content leave me a comment below and uh, we will catch y'all next time